Okay, y'all, I'm going to show y'all an image of my wash and dryer area. Now, this is when we first moved in. So, y'all may, I'm not sure when y'all see this video, okay? So, I'm recording it when we first moved in. So, everything is everywhere. So, but I just want to show y'all my dilemma and what's a project that we're going to be doing. Okay, here is my washer and dryer area right here. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> um, hey, Bentley. All right, here is my new washer and dryers. If y'all remember when I had the other apartment, my washing machine quit spinning. I had water everywhere, yada, yada, yada. I had to go to Lowe's and buy me a new set. So, this is a set I got. It's a Samsung uh, front loader. Love, love, love it. We got a heck of a deal on it because it's got these, um, like, y'all probably can't see it, like scuff marks on it. Um, yeah, y'all can see this one. Um, when Lowe's had came through with the delivery, uh, it scuffed them up. It's actually their, uh, the ones they have on the floor, and it, and it scuffed it right here. So... We, this was normally like $18.98 on sale for a set. Now they're on the pedestals. Anyway, um, about $18, $1,900 plus tax. We got them for $1,000. Okay, y'all. $1,000. Brand new. Awesome deal. Okay. Awesome deal. But if y'all can see, um, on this apartment here, you got to have the dryer on the left and the washer on the right. I've never seen this before. I've always had the washing machine on the right, dryer on the left. Now here in the new apartment, they are done this way. But you can see I had to cock my washing machine to like a little, on the, like a catty corner. And see when I open it up, it barely misses this wall. And here is I open it all the way this side. Well, when I open up the dryer, bam, you see? which I know, granted, I'll be taking from the washing machine, going to the dryer, okay? I see all that, but see, that that just, it's just too cumbersome. I, it, just, it just gets on my nerves, okay? I, I can't stand it. So we're gonna find out something to do differently. Um, I hate to get rid of this set because we got a heck of a deal on it. I keep moving y'all, the cat is underneath my feet, sorry. Um, yeah, he's mad because I moved his food. <laughs> but anyway, we got to figure out what to do in here. So, I've got to get a new set. I know it sounds crazy, but I actually get this sold, buy me another set with that money. Um, it's a brand new set. It, it is what it is because we got a year contract on here, so we can't just... I gotta live like this, and y'all know I can't do it this way. So, I'm getting the um, top loader kind, exactly the Samsung model, but it's gonna be the top loader, okay? Like, you would like the normal. Like, these here are the front loaders. I'm gonna get the top loader in this Samsung version because I really like this, these uh, washing machines. Man, these are really good washer and dryers, y'all. If y'all ever in the market for a new washer and dryer, these Samsung right here are awesome. Love, love, love. This is what it looks like. And up here, this is the only shelf I've got. I just got all of my laundry detergent. I've got all my appliances like my ice cream maker, my KitchenAid mixer. I got my air fryer, let's see, and other whatever. And I put it, that's the only, the only shelf in here. Well, that's not gonna work. So we are going to make new shelves after I get these moved and the new ones in. Um, they're gonna be a little small. I'm gonna uh, add something here to put stuff on. So we, are, this is our project that we're gonna be doing. I'm so sorry. I hope I hadn't just this babbled on and on and on. But my battery is getting <laughs> is going dead. So, all right, y'all. So this this is around. Um, what is today's date? This is June the fourth. Okay, so that's the date I'm filming this. All righty. So this is a work in progress. I'm just showing y'all what it looks like when we first moved in. Um, here, I'm not, I got the kilo liter box on the left um, over that way. I don't want to show y'all that. But here is what it looks like on the floor. Y'all can see where I got my washer is like a catty corner. I just, um, but again, with having these doors, y'all, like this, I mean, look, I mean, it's just, See, so I would have to, when I take my clothes out here, I got to go under both doors and throw the dryer. 
Yes, it's now open. So sometimes I just take all of my clothes out, put in my basket, slide the basket under the door, then throw it in my dryer. But y'all, it's just not. Oh, and for those who are going to say, hey, Sheila, just change the doors. You can't own these. You can't own the dryer, but these have got that sensor to it. And um, there is, um, you can't change the door on the washing machine. You can't change from the left to the right. And I know y'all gonna say, hey, I want you to change the doors. You can't, not on the dryer. I mean, not on the washing machine. So yes, that was gonna be, I was just should have said that earlier. You can't change the door from like right to left or left to right. You can't do that on these, on the washing machine. Now the dryer, you can. So anyway, okay. yes, that's the reason why I can't change the door is because they don't, you can't own the washing machine. So, so what we're gonna do, will be a project y'all, okay? This is a project we're gonna be doing. And I'm gonna show y'all what it looks like in here. I'm gonna back up a little bit. Right here is my pantry door. Oh, and another thing y'all, I had to, used to have to take my step ladder and I had it between the washer and dryer right here because I had to step up up here to pull all of my uh, washing stuff down like I would take it down put it up here when I would start washing and then put it back up after I got done yes that would just uh, so so that's why we're getting new we shoes we're going to do some more stuff in here I've got some decorating I want to do um, and so on and so forth so that so this is what the washer and dryer area looks like okay because yeah, well, y'all can see that. That's my hot water heater. Um, there's a cat litter box right there. So we are going to put up a some kind of a curtain up. I'm gonna hang it like way up, like from this corner to this corner, um, like a tension rod. And I'm gonna have it where it covers all of that stuff right there. Okay, like covers it all. Because, but still let the cat be able to get like underneath it and where he can use his cat litter box. So. This is what the washer and dryer area looks like, okay? Again, I'm so sorry for babbling, talking a mile a minute, but I gotta get off, my battery is going dead. So, hey, well today is June 4th, and this is a project to be continued, okay? See y'all soon. Okay, I'm getting to say goodbye to this set. Um, I'm having to exchange my front letter that I just bought a few months ago and because we were living in an apartment, we have to deal with certain things such as the dryer on the left, the washer on the right, and I'm having to cock my washing machine because y'all, look. And I have to take the clothes out of here, go underneath and throw them in the dryer. And before you ask, you cannot move the door, the door. You can't move it on this side because you can on the dryer, but not the washer. So, my beautiful front letter, brand new Samsung washer and dryer, which I love, 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 highly recommend. I've got to uh, sell these and get, which I'm getting the same version. I've already handled it with Lowe's. We're getting the exact same thing, but it's gonna be a top loader. So I just want to show y'all my beautiful appliances are going bye-bye. <laughs> and this is going to be my next project, y'all. My next project is here in the washer and dryer area. Alrighty, here they are. They got them pulled out. These are my old ones. I hate to say old because <laughs> I love these set. Sucks. But anyway, here it is. And let me go show y'all what it looks like in the area. All right. Okay, here it looks like. Um, you can see this is the empty area before they put the new ones in. So, yep. Alrighty. Let's see what the old. Let's, let's see what the new ones look like. Kind of excited, actually. <laughs> okay, guys, are y'all ready to see them? Lowe's just left, and they've already got them installed. And drum roll, please. <laughs> and here they are. What a difference! Um, as y'all can see, they're identical. 
They are identical to my front loaders. Um, they're the same song, and you can see all of that is exactly how my other one was. All the dials and whatnot. And, um, oh, I cannot get over such a difference in size. Now, here is the washing machine. I still had to put it on this side, which, which is okay, but it's so much difference, um, you know, for its space. Yeah. And, and look, y'all. <laughs> look at the difference in the height and the width. It is such a big difference. Um, I just got my uh, trash can over there. Now, that is the step so I had to use every single time that I went to reach up to get my laundry. I had to get a step so to get my laundry detergent. Then I'll just keep it on top of my dryer while I was, you know, during the time I was washing. Then I'll put everything back up. But no more. Um, cause right here is coming a new shelf right here. I may continue this shelf over and maybe go like this or maybe just stop right here, but we're going to have some shelves here. So excited. I love the difference in the size, how much more room I've got. Love it. Now, now I can finish doing what I got to do. Um, you know, we will get the shelves hung up and I'll film all of that when we get back to this here. So I just want to update y'all on the new set, what it looks like and show y'all the difference in the size and how much more room I've got in here. But like I said, we will come back to this wash and dryer area and we will get it decorated uh, after the shelves are hung and we will start organizing like all of my extra stuff here. And then we will get an area where I can put just my laundry detergent and things like that. We will get all of that on, on separate shelves, you know, because so I won't look so cumbersome and crowded up here. So we'll get all that done, but we will come back y'all. And it's giving probably a few weeks after I get everything else done and organized, then we'll come back in here and we will also get um, the tension rod hung up and we'll hang up the drapery I'm talking about so we can get all of this ugliness hid. And after I figure out what I'm going to do with that, but Y'all, I am so happy on how it looks. I cannot believe the difference in the size. Now, I, you know, don't get me wrong, believe you me. I would have preferred to keep the front loaders because they were gorgeous. I love the pedestals that had room in the bottom. I just loved them. But since, you know, we're living here for a year until we're ready to buy our home, which I'm so wanting to do, but in a way I'm kind of, I'm kind of glad we have them. Um, I was able to ride home with all this mess going on. So there's always a reason for everything, right? <laughs> but okay, y'all, well, I will come back um, to this in a few weeks and we will get to making this all pretty and organized, okay? All right, y'all, I will see y'all real soon. See y'all in a bit. Bye. Okay, guys. Um Hubby is installing a, what size you say this was? Four foot. Four foot shelf. And uh, we can only go so low or can go so high above this one because y'all know in a perfect world, this would be gone. But since we live in an apartment, we got to keep this up. But we're putting a four foot shelf right above the new washer and dryer uh, that we got. So this, this one right here is going to house all of my washing things like that that easy to reach and I had to make sure that the top lid of this washer won't run into that so that all worked out great so here's my shelf and uh, he's already got it screwed in now he's adding the last few screws there you go that's what it looks like all right now we're gonna now we're going to Put all of my washing stuff on this shelf and then on this side of here i don't know what we're going to do i don't know if i'm getting him add a shelf against the back wall or just leave it i think this is enough okay okay just to give y'all an idea on what it's gonna the reason i want this shelf is see now look this is how all of my washing um products and see it's i can reach it so much easier but before I had to have a step stool and y'all can see I'm five foot, five and a half, almost five, six. And it is, I can't reach it all the time. I would have to get a step stool. But now since he put this shelf here, hey, I know uh, it, it works for me. I am so tickled. 
And now we'll, I'll try to organize this. I might get some clear things. I know I get my get something for my little um, my little fresh odor defense little balls, and maybe some clear things for my laundry detergent and whatnot. But make this all look pretty, and then we're gonna add more. I got more, much more room to add like mixers and my toasters, things like that. Oh my goodness, I feel so much more relieved. And of course, I'm gonna take some of that down too. But this is just an idea of what it's looking like so far. Do y'all see the difference? Look, I love it. I really, really like it. All right, y'all, now, okay, let's start uh, going back to decorating. Hang on.